outward questions. Uh, this is also called the knowledge-based questions uh, because the information are often based on consumer's credibility profile. Uh, it's not available even if someone uh, grabs the uh, wallet of the consumer. Okay, so there, there's a uh, driver license, you know, could uh, tell other people what's your name, uh, what's your date of birth, your address, uh, the credit card, if it tells you the credit card number. So, so those questions are not good, right? To really validate your identity. Because if someone uh, picks up your wallet, they can answer that. So uh, these questions are usually to uh, uh, what's your previous address, uh, what other products that you own, so which are not uh, easily available uh, by looking at your uh, wallet. Okay, so these questions are usually used for internet application or phone in application. So there's no face-to-face -face, uh, communication or interaction to validate uh, uh, the identity. Uh, some simple questions are, uh, which address did you leave at previously? This could be as long as, uh, you know, five years ago, 10 years ago, only you know that. So. Um, did you ever have a car loan with a, a particular lender? Okay. Uh, do you have a credit card with uh, a particular bank? Uh, what's the credit limit? Right. So things like that. Uh, usually there's a, a set of questions available. The lender doesn't need to use all of them. The lender can choose which particular questions uh, they like to use. Uh, and also, the consumer doesn't need to answer every question right, right? For example, if the address, uh, if the customer moves quite often in the last uh, 10 years, uh, you might, uh, the customer might forget the exact address, right? Maybe the street number or something like that. So the lender can choose uh, what percentage of the question that have to be answered correctly in order to verify that, that right? It could be three questions out of four uh, correct, or right. all four out of five, correct. Okay, so that's the other worry questions. Uh, one thing is that uh, in recent years, there's more and more data breach. So uh, the consumer's information, credit profile uh, gets sold into the wrong hands, right? So through dark web. So the other questions, the power is, uh, uh, is less powerful as before, but still they are important, right? Uh, the lender usually deploy other tools in combination with uh, uh, these other questions uh, to really do the uh, consumer authentication and uh, identification. Okay. Uh, 